This critical incident community briefing is intended to provide you with information about an officer-involved shooting that occurred in North Hollywood Division in the city of Los Angeles on December 23, 2021. You're about to see relevant video footage and learn about other evidence and police procedures related to the case so you can have a better understanding of what occurred based on what we know right now. Officers assigned to North Hollywood Division responded to a radio call of an assault with a deadly weapon in progress at a business in the 12,100 block of Victory Boulevard. While en route to the location, the officers received multiple radio calls from the same location that there was a possible shooting in progress and there were individuals sheltering in place. Here are several 911 calls and radio broadcasts from this incident. Evacuate the building, everybody! Evacuate the building! What's the emergency? I had a hospital customer in my store attacking, attacking customers. Okay. One, two, one, two, one. Victory way. Okay, ma'am, what was it a male or female? Ma'am, he's breaking things. He's breaking okay. things. Ma'am, ma'am, hello. I need you to listen to me so I can send some help. Yeah. Is it a male or a female? Male. What's the name of your store? Burlington. Closed circuit television video captured the suspect prior to the officer's arrival. In review of the video, it appears the suspect attacked several people. The suspect entered the store with his bicycle at around 11 a.m. and took the escalator up to the second floor. He laid his bike in an aisle and walked around the store putting on clothes. A store employee made contact with the suspect about his bike. The employee left the area and the suspect smashed a computer monitor nearby. He then moved on to hit the glass railing. Next, he took the escalator down and encountered another female. He attempted to take her bag, and as the female resisted, the suspect tackled her and hit her with the lock. That female was able to break away and run out of the store. She was not identified. The suspect waited as another female came down the escalator. He attempted to grab her, but she was able to break free and run out of the store. The suspect then went back up to the second floor, to the area by the dressing room, where he observed a third female pushing a shopping cart. The suspect approached that female from behind and struck her over the head with the bike lock. That female crawled away, and the suspect grabbed her and dragged her near the dressing room and continued to beat her with the lock. As officers arrived at the location, they were directed upstairs to the suspect and began a search. Hey, get distance. Hey, we have a victim down. Victim down. During that search, officers located a female who was suffering from various injuries and bleeding. Hey, she's bleeding. She's bleeding. They encountered the suspect a short distance away, and an officer-involved shooting occurred. The suspect was struck by gunfire and taken into custody. The Los Angeles Fire Department paramedics responded and determined the suspect deceased at scene. Unbeknownst to the officers, a 14-year-old girl was in the changing room behind a wall that was behind the suspect and out of the officer's view. She was in the changing area with her mother when the officers encountered the suspect and the officer-involved shooting occurred. During a search for additional suspects and victims, officers found the girl and discovered she had been struck by gunfire and she was determined deceased at scene. The suspect was later identified as Daniel Elena Lopez, a 24-year-old resident of Los Angeles. We at the LAPD would like to express our most heartfelt condolences and profound regret for the loss of this innocent victim, Valentina Oriana Peralta. There are no words that can describe the depth of the sorrow we feel for this tragic outcome.